This is Samba Plus TV and it's entertainment news where we take you around the ever exciting world of entertainment. We take you around entertainment news, what's trending and we'll make sure you're up to date. Take into our Instagram page during the early hours of Wednesday, March 16, the actress Tonto DK told her followers about Christianity and the afterlife. The actress stated that she was reflecting earlier in the day then when she stumbled upon some dangerous thoughts. She explained that she has seen some people who are not Christians inherit the earth and live better lives than their Christian counterpart. The actress added that there is really no proof that there actually is heaven. What's the guarantee that heaven is real? She wrote. She added that it's okay to lose your love and trust for God. It is okay to question God. She went on to say that she is not ashamed to be weak because she knows she will not be here for long. We hope something bad will not happen to her anytime soon. Tonto, 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 please we need you more. Lagos, the city of excellence, is home to over 20 million people. The city which is characterized by its commercial activities. Like many developed cities, it has its challenges which are peculiar to it. The need to survive has made many Lagosians take up a form of struggle or the other. The everyday hustle and bustle of Lagosians is depicted in a comedy drama movie produced by Asuli Oje. The City Hustlers is a comedy drama movie which tells the story of how people strive to succeed in Lagos. It features Messi Aigbe, Charles Inoje, Bolanle Ninolowo, Asumile Oje, among others. A Nollywood actress, Chama Toplis, has been remanded at the Nigerian Correctional Center of Hara by a magistrate court sitting in Umaye, Abia State, over defamation. The 48-year-old was accused of a lead cybercrime by using her Facebook page to post a malicious publication against the chairman of Abia State Traditional Prime Minister's Council, High Chief Uti Akukwegu, popularly known as Bawas. According to the charge sheet marked 124C-2022, the actress was accused of using her Facebook page to tag Akukwegu as a rapist and a ritualist. In a court document titled Inspector General of Police vs. Chamato Police, F. Age 48, the accused committed the alleged offence between May 28, 2021 and May 31, 2021. After reading the court charge, there was no plea for bail and the trial chief magistrate, Idi Kakalu, ordered that the accused be remanded at the Afara Correctional Center, Omahia. Nigerians have dragged Nollywood actress Iyaba Ojo through the mud after recently trading words with some internet trolls. Mercy Aigbe had no doubt caused havoc for many of her female colleagues as they are no longer free to celebrate married men. Following her relationship with her new husband, Kazim Adeuti began. Iyaba had taken to her Instagram page to pen down a tribute to MC Oluamo and a troll had questioned if she wouldn't end up being Mercy Aigbe's second. According to the female troll, she hopes the actress wouldn't claim to be the owner and snatch his wife. Hope tomorrow you won't claim to be the owner and ignore his wife, Sha, just asking for a friend. I want owner's owner. Not bad. Firing back, Yabo stated that she was spiritually mad. Unfortunately, netizens weren't buying her weak clapback as they lashed out at her for evading the question. Nigeria music star David Adeleke, popularly known as Davido, has promised to give 20 lucky Nigerians with a sum of 20 million naira. <coughs> the billionaire had made this known while reacting to the high cost of living trend on social media. Country hard right now, shao! Let's give 20M to 20 people on Friday. Sending your business ideas or startup ideas. More details shortly. Hashtag WRBLO. He tweeted. It will be recalled that Davido raised 200 million naira over 72 hours after he shared his account details on social media during his birthday in 2021. He went on to donate the entire proceeds to 292 orphanages across the country. A committee was set up then, they managed it very well, and voila, it was fantastic. Join us again tomorrow for more updates on what's going on in the entertainment news right here on Samba Plus TV. I am Josh. Don't forget to subscribe on YouTube page, subscribe Samba Plus TV, on Instagram, Samba Plus TV, on Twitter, Samba Plus TV, on Facebook, Samba Plus TV, everywhere in the world, we are Samba, Samba Plus, Plus TV. Plus TV.